What is up guys? In this video I'm going to show you a little sneak peek into my Facebook Ads Masterclass paid training. So this is a sneak peek, a little bit of a section, three most important sections of the Masterclass that normally cost $100. You get it for free. Check it out. Let me know what you think in the comments or let me know what you think in the group and I hope you enjoy. So this is the first thing and my new strategy for this is I'm going to start out at $5 per day budgets with two audiences. I'm going to start out with two audiences, right? And which two audiences? It depends a lot on the product. So let's say you have one product, you want to test a product. Test a product with one broad audience, meaning a general non-targeted audience, and a targeted audience. Okay, let's say one of the one of the products that we're testing are boots that winter boots for kids. So winter boots for kids. And we're targeting people that like Timberland boots. And then we're doing a general audience. So the same, you know, winter boots. Then we're doing a general women 30, no, 25 to 45 audience. So essentially, you, talk, you start out with two, but two audiences, right? $5 a day budgets. Start out with two audiences so that you make sure that we essentially get a very broad audience, just gender and age, and then you get a very targeted audience. So people that like Timberland boots and people that are interested in other different brands of boots. Um, so I started out at $5 per day and I'm increasing in this way. So I'm increasing at 5, 10, 15, 20, 30, right? So I'm going in that um, scaling direction. I'm going to 5, 7, 10, 15, 20, 30. And then I'm doing 50 and then I'm doing from there on I just do a hundred. And then usually either I go from 50 to that. I usually, I just go from 50 to 500 and the manual bit. All of you guys pretty much know how to do dynamic retargeting ads, right? Um, I mean, there's, there's a module on the course on it and you guys pretty much know how to do this. Now, the main key here comes in testing these audiences right don't always trust facebook facebook you know they want to make the most money from you as possible so when they give you these facebook suggested audiences facebook suggested audiences it's probably not going to work as well right so you're, you're going to try um 14 days so what i do is i try different age sections so i try 14 days vc plus atc 30 days vc plus atc 90 days you know 90 days and then 180 days but the better way to do it is actually to create your own retargeting um, custom audience so here when you create a new dynamic retarget ad set usually facebook will suggest doing retarget products to people who have visited your website or app that's usually what facebook suggests you and yeah, that's fine to test that, right? View it and add to cart for 5th, 14, 30 days, 90 days, whatever. That's completely okay. You can test that. The better way to do it, and something that I really, really wanted to share with you guys, is show relevant products to prospective customers, even if they haven't visited your website and app. Now, what this means is Facebook is essentially letting you create your own audience, like a custom audience or, oops, my bad creating a custom audience or lookalike audience or whatever you want to do by using this section, right? You're not, essentially you're not using the suggested one from Facebook, but you're using your own one. And what I recommend doing here is custom audience of, instead of actually suggested do custom audiences and do 180 days visits, 180 days ATC, and then always exclude purchase. So test these two versus, so you test those two, 180 day visits, 100 day ATC. So essentially it's 180 days of people that visited your site and 180 days of add to cart. You, or you can create it right here. Um, you don't even have to go to the audience section. Just create it right here, custom audience. 180 is working the best right now. Disclaimer, it doesn't always work the best. It's working 
this is, is the same than content view. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, um, you can just do um, view content. Yeah, uh, 180 days view content. Um, 180 days is working the best right now. I'm talking about what is working right now. You have to test, uh, I would test, suggest 14, 30, 90, and 180, and 180 days. So this are the different audiences that I recommend you test um, and always exclude purchase. And the even more targeted thing would be doing, for example, here, 180 days ATC plus an interest. That has been working really well. Working really well. So if you have an interest that's you know overperforming, it's really getting some really nice um, purchase value. It's really getting you know a nice return on ad spend. What you can do is combine that interest with that retargeting. All right, guys. Thank you so much for checking out that sneak peek into my Facebook Ads Masterclass. If you're interested in a free one-on-one -on -one call with me to learn how to apply these different strategies, Facebook Ads, Google Ads, Instagram Ads, on how to grow your own Shopify store, click the first link in the description or the link below to schedule a one-on-one -on -one call with me in the next couple days so you can see how you can apply all these strategies and grow your business in 2019. I'll see you on the call and until next time.